good morning we are starting off another vlog i just got ready for the gym it's almost seven it's thursday if you're new here welcome to my channel my name is diana if you're not new welcome back i am ready to get this workout out of the way i have a lot of work stuff to do today lots of cleaning doing all of that good stuff but it's gonna be a good and busy and productive day and i'm excited to take you guys along i'm wearing these new leggings that are actually from navigation they are so comfortable they're so soft and so stretchy they don't give you camel toe that is a big pro and then the sports bra is from aloe i've had it for a while but i'm kind of digging the gray on gray look today i think i'm gonna toss on a gray sweater i don't know why but i woke up this morning and it was sunny and now it looks like it's gonna be gloomy today but i'm crossing my fingers that changes really quickly i made some pre-workout i'm gonna fill up my flask grab my bag and then we are off to go work out I'm going to use my sos spray i feel a little bit blotchy and a little bit puffy today because last night we went out and we got dinner indian slash indonesian restaurant i think we had this like butter chicken blah, beef rendang roti dumplings like it was a really good meal i don't think my body is like very into that cuisine because i was so bloated after and i feel like today i'm like looking a little puffy anyways the more that you work with your body and the more that you learn like what works for you and what doesn't it's a lot easier for you to tell when something is causing a disturbance within your body and not i'm not saying that the indian food caused a disturbance but i am saying that you it's a lot easier for you to tell what works for you versus what doesn't when you start paying attention to exactly what you're putting into your body how you're exercising how much you're sleeping all of that good stuff like i've been really making it a priority to be very in tune with my body anytime that i get out of my routine or do something that is not something that i typically do it's always very easy for me to identify exactly what caused the disturbance i hope that makes sense anyways it's gonna be a good day i think i'm gonna need to stop by and get a coffee somewhere feeling a little a little sleepy today gym is done and i'm almost home i just had some scrambled eggs which i did not document obviously because they were not aesthetically pleasing but look at this yogurt bowl beautiful all of these berries are from the farmer's market there's a little bit of mixed berry jam that i got from one of our favorite bakeries okay so i have written out pretty lengthy to-do list for today like i said it's going to be a busy busy day i have divided my day into three major tasks i have house stuff work stuff side hustle stuff so i've done a little bit of work already basically everything that is priority and then I'm starting off with the house stuff by tackling the bathroom first. I wanna do a little bit of organizing, which I kind of did already. These two crates right here, they have like all of my hair stuff, tanner stuff, just like miscellaneous things that I need. So I've already organized those. Now I'm just gonna scrub everything down, clean the bathroom, make sure it's nice, tidy, clean, perfect. And then after that, we have the bedroom, we have the kitchen, we have the fridge, and I also want to declutter some of my clothing. So it's gonna be a nice, busy, jam-packed day. I'm feeling pretty motivated to clean, actually. I have my Starbucks coffee that I'm still <laughs> drinking, and it's, it's almost out. So I need to run over to Target, actually, to pick up some more pods and a couple of other things that I need to get from there. I have, if you're wondering why I have these on, it's to protect my manicure because every time I clean, I destroy my nails and they're too expensive for me to constantly get them like ruined from cleaning. But anyways, let's get to cleaning. I'm turning on, or I'm finishing up a podcast right now by the Wellness Mama and then I'm just gonna start a new one. So it's gonna be a nice, educational cleaning session.
bathroom is done and organized and nice and clean so i'm happy about that now i'm gonna move into the bedroom and i'm gonna start decluttering and tidying up the space and i'm gonna get like a big bag to put all of the clothing that i don't want when my sisters come i'm gonna have them go through it and then whatever they don't want i'm gonna donate it mihai is so sweet he stopped by and dropped me off a juice it's carrot apple ginger and mint from juice crafters and i am still cleaning clearly still stuck in the bedroom this is the giveaway donate bag but i'm reorganizing these i put like all of my shorts and home tops here and then i hung up all my dressy tops because i had them in here originally i feel like this is nice and organized i have these cubicles that i got from ikea so it's like nice these are all tank tops these sports bras bralettes things like that now i'm going to fold some laundry and organize my oversized shirts into these okay bedroom is done clothing is organized <laughs> All right, I am done cleaning. I just washed these pillowcases. I'm going to put these on. I have literally three, four, just a couple of pages left of this book. This book was phenomenal. It was so, so good. I enjoyed it. Such a good book. Anyways, I'm going to finish this right now. I have a beautiful face mask on because Mihai and I are going to the sauna and I just did my brows. Like I just plucked a little bit and while i read i'm just gonna sit it has to sit for 10 minutes then he's gonna come home and we're gonna go to the sauna and then after that i'm gonna make dinner hi hello i just got back from the sauna and now i'm making some dinner with this carbone arrabbiata pasta i'm so excited this sauce sounds incredible so i have my ground bison here cooking with some onions pasta water and some mushrooms that I'm cooking in some raw butter, so it'll be delicious. Right here is the pasta, meat sauce, spaghetti, sauteed mushrooms on the side, some raw parmesan. Had enough for leftovers for Mihai for lunch tomorrow. Bon appetit. I just ordered this yesterday. Let's try it. I think I've had it before and I think I like it. Outfit from Aritzia, as always. I just stopped by Blue Bottle and I got the iced Nola with some whole milk. It is so good, perfectly sweet. I am walking home. I'm almost home. It's gloomy, which is unfortunate. But anyways, I had a super good workout, and I'm trying to figure out what exactly I want to start doing because I have a lot of errands. I need to go to Target. TJ Maxx, Paxson, and I need to go return something at Zara. So it's gonna be a busy day. Plus I'm hungry, I wanna go eat. So I think I'm gonna stop by the house first, drop my gym bag off, and then we'll go eat and then run our errands. I think, we'll see, it kinda smells here. <sighs> okay, I am home. I just made a quick breakfast. I'm having scrambled eggs with sauteed mushrooms and onions and hot sauce. Gonna eat this and then head out to run my errands. Okay, I'm still hungry, so I just made a yogurt bowl with berries, honey, and some jam. I'm back from 
my little shopping trip. I want to go sit in the balcony and read and tan. That's why I have my bikini top on. But I just showered and I'm going to let my hair air dry. But yeah, I hit up TJ Maxx. Hexen and Zara because I had to do a return at Zara as well. So I wanted to show you what I got. I actually really wanted to buy a vase at um, ooh, at TJ Maxx and I didn't find one. So starting off with this, this is my favorite leave-in conditioner. It adds a lot of shine. It's a good detangler and it smells really good. So I put this into my hair every time that I shower. I also love going to TJ Maxx and finding things that I would normally get at Sephora that are significantly more expensive and then getting them for a very cheap amount. So I got this little um, exfoliating thing from First Aid Beauty, which I love. And then I just got a little, what are these called? <laughs> Brush and some of these. So that's what I got at TJ Maxx. Let me show you all the other stuff. So at Zara, I got this dress, which is really long and so beautiful. The material actually feels really nice on your skin. And yeah, it's really pretty. I like it that it's strapless. It's perfect for summer. I'll put like a little clip of me trying it on. And then I picked up this little perfume from Zara as well. I never got perfumes from them before, but this smelled really nice and it's like... On the go so it's perfect and then i stopped by target to get nespresso pods and i got these little black sandals i thought that they would match maybe for dinner tonight i went to pack sun and i'm so happy about this bikini because it is so cute and they were having a sale where if you buy the top you get the bottoms for free so super cute and these are like a little little a little coverage um, so my mom will be very happy about that. And then I got this little green crochet top, which is actually stunning. I'm going to have to figure out the nipple situation because I tried it on and you can definitely see the nipples. So I'm going to have to figure that out. And then I just got a plain white cotton tank top. And this, as you can tell, I'm in a green era of my life. I got this oversized lime green hoodie just for you know, working out, walking around, etc. So it was a very successful shopping trip. All right, I just made some coffee and I'm going to take both of these out into the balcony with me, some lemon water and, you know, stay hydrated while I dehydrate myself with caffeine. I just did my hair. I am just obsessed with crimping it lately and just adding that day wave spray it is my absolute favorite and it makes your hair smell so good so anyways i've been reading on the balcony i finished my dark vanessa which was such a good book such a good book and i just started reading the goldfinch which is supposed to be a really really good novel and i'm just a couple pages in but so far i'm enjoying it it's a little chilly outside so i brought a blanket out blanket out but my my chest is still getting tan but i'm trying to save my legs from the sun because i'm supposed to get laser on sunday so it's one o'clock time because we've done everything we need to do today we deserve to treat ourselves this wine is from whole foods it is an organic wine made with organic grapes it's italian it's my second time buying it it is so good it is one of my favorite wines that i've ever had so if you're looking for a nice crisp white wine try to find this at your whole foods it has like the lightest hint of sweetness which makes it so good i always need to rinse my glasses out because i feel like they just sit there and collect dust throughout the week and yeah like i have it now anyways Happy weekend. Also, it's Mother's Day on Sunday. So all the, all the mothers that might be watching my channel, I know that I have like different age ranges, but if you are a mom, happy Mother's Day. So good. All right, I just got ready for dinner. Because it's chilly outside, I'm wearing the jeans and not the dress that I mentioned that I was gonna wear, but I'm wearing the new top that I got from 
Paxson. I put some boob tape so that my nipples are not see-through. So I feel like this is a nice little pre-summer outfit. And yeah, we're off to get food. I'm starving. Okay, we are very early for dinner because our reservations are at 7.45. So we're gonna go get a drink first. And the first place we went to is packed. So we're trying out a new mezcal bar. So we'll see how that goes. up at 8 slept in today till 8 which is a big big shocker but anyways for whatever reason it's cloudy outside which is absolutely ridiculous and hopefully that changes it's supposed to be almost 80 degrees in Beverly Hills from when I checked yesterday and I hope that hasn't changed but anyways we're going to go to get some pastries 75 75 is good um, we're gonna go get some pastries. I'm dressed to go to the gym. We're going to go to Mihai's gym today, 24. So that way we could sit in the sauna. And yeah, outfit of the day. This is from, this is Steffi. Steffi. And then my legging or shorts are from Lulu. I'm, I feel like I'm all over the place. But anyways, yeah, let's go to the gym get this workout done and then go have a very very good and fun day i'm excited <laughs> Just came home from the gym and from going into the sauna, sat in there for 25 minutes and it was hot. And I'm about to go shower, get ready, and then we're off to Beverly Hills. And I think we're gonna try to figure out like where we're gonna go. There are a couple of new bars that I really wanna try out, but I'm not sure if I need reservations for them. So going to figure that out. I'm so excited to get dolled up. I'm gonna wear that dress that I got yesterday. So yeah, I'm excited. Let's get to it. Cute, love, obsessed. All right, getting ready to head out. I just blow dried my hair and I'm going to crimp it. This is my current favorite toner. I love how it smells and it makes my skin feel really hydrated. It smells like a cucumber, like a watermelon cucumber margarita. I'm going to use this uh, Sunday Riley little moisturizer that I have because my other moisturizers in the bathroom and Mihai's showering so I love how this moisturizer smells it has vitamin C which is great and my skin is so dry especially after the sauna okay I'm gonna do my uh, tanning droplets I think I'm just gonna actually use my hands because I feel like that ball absorbs all of the tanner. Okay, for brows, just gonna brush them and add my usual gel. Highlighter time. A little bit of blush. I'm going to apply the setting spray and then we're going to curl our lashes. That is the secret to ensure that they don't fall. I genuinely think that this 
setting spray really really helps keep everything intact the only thing is that I have not tried to put this on first and then apply everything because I keep forgetting I forgot to add a little highlighter into like my eye crease picked up two iced espressos listening to the new Jonas Brothers album and heading to Beverly Hills I'm wearing the dress that I got from Zara yesterday I'm kind of nervous because it keeps falling but I think it'll be fine and I brought like an entire bag with me of stuff because we're planning on being out all day and I'm like nervous that I'm gonna need something so I got heels with me because we're gonna go to that bar least tonight and I feel like it's really fancy and we're going to Beverly Hills right now and I'm wearing the heels but I also got the sandals the ones that I got from Reformation and I brought like my eyelash curler in case my eyelashes fall and I want to look good for that bar tonight because it's like a nice rooftop bar and I brought like a jacket with me and everything so I'm prepared but I'm pretty hungry right now so we're gonna get some food and yeah it's gonna be such a good day i'm excited i love having the day planned out it's it's my favorite having a little snack at the hideaway which was super fun and then Miha took me shopping and I got a lot of goodies so I'll show you what we got but we're on our way to our second spot that we're going to which is called what is it called Davy's Wayne a good time at Davy's a good time at Davy Wayne's so let's go okay so Mostly, I wanted the Thatcher Dewey cream, which is what we got. And then I was looking for the Kopari sunscreen slash tanning droplets. It's like a way to make you shimmery, but it also has SPF in it, and they don't sell that. So instead, we got the Tan Lux Super Gloss tanning drop they're like it's like a sunscreen but they're illuminating bronzing drops and I tried them on my hand which you can't tell but my hand looks stunning and I just applied it to my chest so I'm anticipating the sparkliness and then we also got the tower 28 lip gloss which I have on right now and it is the perfect color I got it in coconut it's like a very natural sparkly shiny pink anyways that's it We just got done at good time at Davy Jones. I believe that's what it's called. They had happy hour there. It was so cute because it's like this outdoor seating area. It kind of feels like you're in somebody's backyard, which personally I prefer. 
I'm using these Blot and Glow blotting wipes from Rare Beauty. But anyways, we just got done there. And they were having a happy hour, which was really nice. So I had an April spritz. I'm so shiny. It was like 75 degrees in Beverly Hills. And I feel like I started sweating a little. But anyways, at da Davy Jones, it was so cool because when you walk in, you're walking into... It's called Davy Jones? A good time at Davy Wayne. A good time at Davy Wayne's. When you walk in, you're walking into a refrigerator, and then it's like this, like, old school bar. And then you're basically in somebody's backyard. Now we're gonna go to Bar Lease, and it's on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. So we're just gonna walk around and go there. And yeah, it's gonna be nice. And I'm going to. use my little SOS spray that has been saving me today by Tower 28 and I'm gonna recomb my lashes <laughs> reapply this this is such a pretty color And we're good to go to our next place. We can go. Ready? You never know. very good like lychee drink it was delicious delectable and i think we're gonna go drive to the hollywood sign and stop by somewhere else you know? the options are limitless look how beautiful it is here no you wouldn't have to fuck we are on the hollywood walk of fame you want to stay here for a second yeah We're gonna go to some bar nearby that we just found on Yelp and then I think after that we're gonna get some food. We only had drinks at Barley's but that is the perfect date night spot and if it wasn't cloudy I feel like the sunset would have been stunning. Just bought two records, Frank Sinatra and Elvis Presley. Good morning, it is Sunday, it is Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day. And we are off to go get some breakfast. It's 11 and we're both starving. We're gonna go get some bagels and then I have my laser appointment right after. So we're gonna head to Sherman Oaks, so it's gonna be a nice, hopefully a quick drive hopefully there's no traffic it's pretty gloomy but we checked the weather and it's saying that it's gonna get like better it's like nice and it's like stuffy so i think it'll be warm enough to like go walking go exploring go have a nice day um but yeah laser and then grocery shopping and then we're gonna go home change and just like go out and We'll see. We'll see what we get into, but we're gonna go to our favorite bagel spot right now. They have sourdough bagels. Everything is delicious and sustainably sourced. 
all of that good stuff. I'm gonna get an everything bagel with heirloom tomatoes and cucumbers. Uh, yeah, I'm very excited. I'm wearing my new hoodie that I got from Paxson today, the green one, even though it's really warm out, so. Yeah, yesterday was such a fun day, so I'm excited to have another fun day as well. Okay, laser hair is done. It was a rough session. It was very painful today. They did it on a higher setting, but we pulled through and we just went grocery shopping and we actually went to a Whole Foods that's closer to us than the normal one that we go to. So we're saving time. And I got us these two hemp shots with sea moss to try. Mihai, look, this has coconut water, coconut vinegar, coconut nectar, lemon juice, hemp seed oil, and sea moss for your gut. Oh, okay. Oh, convertible. Cheers. That doesn't taste tasty at all. I don't know how your camera is staying up. It's better than your tripod. Uh. I always wanted to try sea moss. Just go out to the ocean and eat some. Okay, we're gonna do a super, super quick grocery haul because I'm trying to leave. Cilantro for guac. I got some spaghetti to make pasta this week. I got some ice cream sandwiches. These are the perfect sweet treat at the end of the night. Got some bananas. I got a couple packages of ground bison. I got this Amatriciana sauce. This is my second time buying this exact brand. I really like it. Tastes really good, actually. Some sauerkraut. And Japanese sweet potatoes. Super excited about this. It's a turmeric tea with black pepper. And then also excited about this. As you know, I'm obsessed with the maple and brown sugar oatmeal from Trader Joe's. However, the Trader Joe's one has a lot of bad ingredients in it. And this one doesn't. So we're going to try it. Limes for um, guac. I got a juice, cold pressed juice. This one is really good. Hawaiian pear. I got... Another shot, this one's for digestion. I'm gonna take that now. More bison, a little baby watermelon. Some Greek yogurt. This brand is actually fantastic. Last bag, some cherry tomatoes for guac. I got a large heirloom tomato because I wanna make homemade burgers with the bison. This is Mihai's shot. A cucumber for Greek salad. Avocados. Some beef skirt steak for dinner tomorrow. Feta for Greek salad tomorrow. I got one of my culture pop sodas. I also got some raw Gruyere cheese for burgers. Apricot jam. This is my favorite coconut water. So good. Last but not least, I got some more dessert for the week. This, I was actually really craving this right now. But these chocolates are amazing. The ingredients are great. There's no like added junk in them. Love, 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 love Theo. So this one is black rice quinoa crunch. This one is dark chocolate with orange, which I love fruit and chocolate. This one is delicious. This is a coconut one. This one's my favorite because it reminds me of a Bounty bar. And I don't actually think that this is like a healthier version of Bounty because I'm pretty sure that they have... Oh no, this is good. Yeah, so always check the ingredients because a lot of times you'll find things like palm oil or like seed oils or whatever in healthier alternatives, but this one doesn't have any, so we're good. And we're gonna have it now.
tastes so good. It's so good. I'm gonna put it in the fridge. It's gonna taste better. here i hope you guys enjoyed it we had a great night last night we checked out a new spot called Gran blanco which was so much fun i've always wanted to go there it's stunning i had my first espresso martini there and it was delicious absolutely delicious and then we came home we watched a little bit of tv and we went to bed and yeah it was a great weekend so anyways i'm gonna make some pre-workout to go and head to the gym and edit this vlog so thank you so much for watching if you guys liked it please give me a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and i will see you in the next vlog bye